What's been the highlight every day? I ate a really good everything bagel for breakfast. Honestly, waking up, I got coffee when I woke up, had some eggs. It's always the simple things, bro. You look good in your glasses, by the way. Uh, we've had three people buy our pumpkin bread. Uh, people buying pumpkin bread. Okay, I'll buy some pumpkin bread. <laughs> okay, what's been the highlight of your day? Um, I went to the gym this morning. Um, being here with my friends. I just love the weather right now. Like, the sunrise this morning was really beautiful. Uh, getting lunch with my friends. I haven't seen them in a while. Um, the highlight of my day is starting my new class, which is a chemistry and Spanish cooking class, and the professors were really nice. Really pretty, by the way. Um, my highlight was waking up on time, even though I forgot to set an alarm this morning. Um, waking up this morning. Truth or truth? Truth. What's the most painful thing you've ever been told? Somebody told me that I was too black. Right. Truth or truth? Truth. What's your favorite compliment someone's given you? My favorite compliment someone's given me. I've been told that the way, like how easily I love people. Truth or truth? Truth. When's the last time you felt understood? Understood? Oh my god. That was like a long time ago. <laughs> um, I don't really know. Maybe whenever... I like talked to my best friend about something. It was like I was like talking to her about my struggles and she was just like agreeing and she was like, yeah, I get what you mean. I was like, this is why you're my best friend. Okay, truth or truth? Truth. <laughs> When's the last time you felt misunderstood? Misunderstood? Um, probably, I feel like it's been a while. <laughs> probably like a couple months back when I was going through some stuff um, and people didn't understand because they haven't gone through the same thing. What's up, bro? I just want to say I love you guys' videos. I just want to say you always should always be in our video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be honest, I was hoping that answer. <laughs> All right, bro. Truth or dare? This is crazy. <laughs> Truth. All right, what's your biggest insecurity? Probably my weight. My entire life, I was like always like a big boy. And like now I kind of rock the dad bod. Or my height. <laughs> hey, we're switching to the height part. All because right. if I was 6'3", I would rule this world. But I'm not, because God had to nerf me a little bit. So Coming from a 5'3", dude, I agree a little bit. Truth or dare? Truth. What's your biggest insecurity? Oh, probably my skin. I have pimples. <laughs> it's looking pretty radiant in the sun. Truth or dare? Um, truth. What's an embarrassing memory you have? Oh my god, I was at my friend's house and we were having like a girls' night and I was walking outside and the glass was there and I... Truth or dare? I'll say dare. Go hug a random stranger. Oh, okay. Can I give you a hug? Absolutely. Oh my god, yes. Oh, that was such a nice hug. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Truth or dare? Uh, truth. What's your happy place? Um, well, it's not a place. I would say, like, music would be my happy place. Like, usually I put on sad music, but, like, also sad music could be my happy place. I appreciate you. You're really beautiful, right? Thank you. <laughs> Truth to there. Truth. What's a battle you've been fighting, but no one sees? Probably my anxiety. Social anxiety. You know, a lot of people like to think that I kind of got it together, but I didn't want people to see that, so that was kind of a battle I had. Truth to there. Dare. Go hug a random stranger. Hug a random stranger. Hey, can I give you a hug? Of course. <laughs> You too. <laughs> truth or dare? Uh, truth. What's your happy place? My happy place? Probably the gym. That's always helped me get my mind off things. Question is, truth or dare? Truth. When I say the word love, what, what or who comes to mind? My boyfriend. Okay. I'm sorry, I just want to say hi. Okay. <laughs> Today we're asking truth or dare? Truth. Where's your happy place? Probably my friends. They just it's get good. me. Yeah. It's like the best place with them, so. Truth or dare? Dare. Uh, no, call a homie and tell him you love him. Bad, bad, bad. I got you. Only the real homies answer, you feel me? Yeah. Yo, Omari. What up? Hey, just wanted to call to say I love you, brother. G? <laughs> yeah, brother, I really love you, bro. Thank you for everything. I got you, under. Yeah, anytime. I love you too, dog. What happened? Nah, nothing, man. Sometimes you just gotta tell the homies you love them. Dang, wow. I appreciate it. Yeah, I really appreciate it. Truth it is. Truth. When I say love, who comes to mind? My dad and my mom. They're who I love the most in my life, you know? Can I get you to call one of them? And tell them you love them? Tell them, yeah, I could do that. Hey, what up, Pops? What are you doing? I just wanted to tell you I love you. Why? Because you need to hear that. I love you too. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you really just call us how you love me? Yeah. Oh my god, I love you. Thanks. Alright, I'll talk to you later. That was best part of my day. Thanks, son. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Bye. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Truth or dare? Truth. When I say love, who do you think about? My mom and dad. Truth or dare? Dare. Um, I dare you to call your friend and tell them that you love them. Okay. Hello? Hey, uh, I just want to call you and tell you that I love you. Oh, that's so nice, Anissa. I love you too. <laughs> I love you more. I'll talk to you soon.
Okay, I literally was like, Anissa's calling you. That's so weird. <laughs> okay, bye. Oh, I love you. Love bye. you. Bye. Truth or dare? Dare. Can you hug a stranger? I'll ask people. <laughs> Uh, the point of that is just to get out of your comfort zone. Yeah, I don't so. really normally do that. <laughs> do you feel uncomfortable right now? <laughs> a little, but it's okay. That's why I'm proud of you for that. <laughs> she doesn't even hug us. <laughs> hey. Uh, that's okay, that's okay. Hey, you win some, you lose some. We vibe. You want to hug back? Yeah. Hey, yeah. you have a good one. Gotta get somebody my height, because I was a little bit awkward. That guy was tall. I found him. Excuse me, what's your name? So I'm just going around hugging people. If you're comfortable with that, I'd love to give you a hug. Hey, thank you, man. I'll see you later, William. Yeah. Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, can I give you a hug? Of course. Have a good day. You too. <laughs> can I give you a hug? <laughs> I always see these videos. Yo, bro, you look awesome, man. I gotta. I, they told me I gotta hug a stranger. Hi, right, dog. Come here, bring it in, man. Hey, God. Have a great day. <laughs> Truth or dare? Truth. All right, what's something you've been told that helped you get through a tough time? Well, the tough time would be my best friend passed away recently. It's my dad who, him and I are not like always the best of friends, but he also had a friend from college who passed away. But he told me that he also felt the same way and that it gets better and that you will feel better and that the day gets easier. You know what's funny? Because this was actually told to me today. Whenever you're not feeling loved, you have to give love. So many people don't feel loved by the world, but are they giving it? What's your biggest insecurity? Probably gonna say like, I think sometimes I kind of doubt whether my friends are my friends because like they like me and whether to just be like, just because like they feel bad for me instead or something, you know? Yeah. I definitely feel that for sure. Yeah, man. If you don't mind, when is the most recent time you felt that? Um, I haven't felt in a while. I've had a really good group of friends for a good part now. It was mostly in high school I had that feeling a lot though. So what do you think they would feel bad for you about? Like just being alone. Okay, so what do you have to say to anybody that feels alone? There's someone out there for you, you know? You just gotta find the right people, find the right people who uh, who love you, respect you. You'll know who they are when you come by them. Mm -hmm. hey, I appreciate it. Yeah, man. I've seen your videos, I think, I around. Mm -hmm. Truth or dare? Dare. Call a homie and let him know you love him. All right. Call Jason. Yo, what's Whoa. up? I was just calling to let you know I love you, bro. Hey, this isn't your move to call on me, dog. <laughs> Like, if it was like, yo, bro, I love you, this ain't, this ain't your fault, that's me, dog. I'm the one who's gonna kill themselves in this relationship, <laughs> not you. I don't have to worry about that. Fuck you, cuz. Fuck you. <laughs> no, I just kind of said I love you, bro. <laughs> love you too, cuz. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs> yo, that is the funniest answer I think we've ever got, bro. <laughs> Why'd you choose to call him? Uh, he's my roommate. I've known him for, like, four or five years, so we're pretty close. Good day, bro. I appreciate you, Ryan. Have a good day, y'all. You too, bro. Love the video. Thank you. Truth or dare? Truth. What's your biggest insecurity? Uh, definitely, like, my height. How tall are you? Like, 5'8", five, 5'9". Five, What's your biggest insecurity? Damn. My height. 5'10". She got me thinking last time was the last time no one